Hello everyone, in this video I'll show you how to download Python and Visual Studio Code in your computer. For this video I'll be using Python 3.7.3 in this link which I'll be providing in the video description. So firstly, once you reach the web page, you have to scroll down and you'll reach file, the installer files. So after you've reached the installer files, if you're using Windows, then you need to download the Windows installer. If you're using Mac OS, then you have to download a Mac installer. For this video, for this video, I'll be using Windows installer. After you've, done, after you've downloaded the installer, open it. Click on this checkbox and then click install now. After you have downloaded Python, close the installer. Now we need to download Visual Studio Code. So firstly, go to the link code.visualstudio.com which will be provided in the description of the video. Next, you need to download the installer. So if you're using Windows, then click download for Windows. If you're using Mac OS, then download the stable version for the Mac OS Visual Studio Code installer. So since I'm using Windows, I'll download the Windows installer. So after the installer has downloaded, open it. After the installer is opened, click on I accept the agreement, then click next. Then ensure that the file path is correct. If you want to change it, you can go ahead and change it. I'll click next. Then again, click next. Then create a desktop icon so that you can open Visual Studio Code easily. Then click next. Then click install. After Visual Studio Code has installed, then click Finish. After you have downloaded Visual Studio Code, you need to set it up for Python programming. So go to the sidebar and click on Extensions. And then type Python Microsoft. Then click on the first search result and then click install. After Py the Python extension has downloaded, you can close it and then go back to the file explorer. So after going back to file explorer, you have to open a folder in which you'll write your Python code. So click open folder and then I'll create a folder in desktop. After that, select the folder and click on the select folder button. After Visual Studio Code has reloaded, you need to create a file and call it hello.py and click enter. Since the font size is a little small, I'll enlarge it by going to settings. So, so after changing the font size, type in print hello world. Ensure that your brackets and quotes are in the correct place. And then this circle icon shows that your file hasn't been saved. So to enable auto saving in Visual Studio Code, you need to click on file and auto save. So after your fi file has saved, then you have to click on run, click on the run button. Yeah. 
if your code prints out hello world that means your setup is complete and correct thank you